Hey ladies and gentlemen, Steven here from Red Adolescence. Welcome back to another review. Thank you all so much for tuning in. Today I'm joined by my friend Chris from Casual Fragrances. How you doing everybody? His link is going to be down below as well, so definitely make sure to check him out. And in today's episode, we're going to be taking a closer look at a fragrance by the company Maison Francis Kirk John, and this one is called Gentle Fluidity Silver, so stay tuned. So this fragrance was released in 2019, and this is the silver version. Full disclosure, this is Chris's bottle. He actually brought it over so that we can both review it. And this is part of a collection of two fragrances. So you have the silver and you have the gold. So the thing with both of these fragrances is that they were meant to be unisex, short of gender bender. Anybody can wear them, male or female. And this one has more of a spotlight on the nutmeg and the ambery woods in it. Whereas the other one with the gold cap has a different ratio of the same exact ingredients. So, being as though this is your bottle and you're the guest, I would like you to start off. What do you get in terms of the smell? Um, when you first open it up, you are going to get reminders of Green Irish Tweed or GIT, whatever you want to call it. If you're a fragrance, and that, yeah, you probably right? know that. Uh -huh. uh, and after that, it fades away a little bit and you get more, it opens up to Junior for Berries, which is nice and fresh. And then towards the dry down the fragrance, I get a lot more of the musk and I get some of the vanilla in it. Yeah, but this isn't like a sweet, sweet, like the gold one. It's the gold exactly, is in the spray. Yeah. Was, you know, that's more uh, sweet on the skin. Or on my skin when I spray at Neiman Marcus. Yeah, so like Chris said, both of them do contain vanilla. I personally find that the gold version does have more vanilla, like Chris said. And this one, I can kind of see what he means with that GIT reference where it does kind of smell fresh and green and inviting, like green Irish tweed, minus perhaps the lemon verbena. But I think there's another citrus uh, ingredient in here that kind of gives off that vibe. So it's really interesting. And I personally find it to be pretty unique. Now, what did you get from this one in terms of longevity? Now, longevity was really good. I got through a whole work day. Now, majority of the time I got eight hours. Sometimes I got 10 or 11. All depends. Well, people could smell it off me after 11, 12 hours. But the longest I smell was like eight hours on my skin, which I could detect of it. That's not bad. Which That's is really nice. not bad, yeah. Because yeah. it, it kind of, to me, it reminds me of some of the lighter offerings from the brand, like Aqua Vitae and oh, Aqua yes. Universalis or Cologne Pour Le Matin. So to hear eight hours from this one is pretty solid. And he definitely has a way of utilizing musk ingredients in a sense that uh, he can get really good longevity from them. So this one, I sprayed on skin maybe only twice, once at my friend Carlos's house a few months ago, and then once in stores, but I don't quite remember how long it lasted on my skin. But I was able to smell it for a good amount of time after I put it on. And what about occasions for this? Occasions, I feel like this could be a signature scent. Like if you work in an office, it projects, but it's not like beast mode where it's like yeah. loud like other fragrances can be. You know, but this one's nice, and I feel like it's a summer and spring fragrance more. But like I said, if you're in a, a controlled environment, you're inside an office or, you know, have that type of job, you can wear it all year round and it's pleasing. I've got two compliments wearing this fragrance, one at work and one when I just go in to run errands. Yeah. And my lovely girlfriend, Kelly, she got a compliment wearing it too. Oh, that's so awesome. It's, it's, Given the price point, it's the type of fragrance that people would wait to wear for like a formal occasion. But as always, you know, please wear your fragrances, enjoy them as much as you can. It's not necessarily something that you need to wait for the right moment because the smell of this one is so good, in my opinion, that it's something that I would prefer to wear on a daily basis, like you said as well. Yeah. So any concluding thoughts? Um, the presentation is beautiful, like all the fragrances are. It really yeah. are. You know what I mean? I'm just like very shocked how like this is my first one I ever bought. I never bought any of them. And they have a beautiful lineup. And I yeah. went there and I sprayed this one and I was just like, I sprayed it and I was just, I fell in love with it. Like, I want to buy this. And that doesn't happen. Many friends, like I smell it, tested a few times. I sprayed it on my skin. I'm like, the first initial breath, I'm like, I want to buy it. <laughs> I, mean, I, had to, I had to wait for it, but I eventually got it. I'm very blessed I have it in my collection. Yeah, there's just something about MFK scents, and I own maybe three or four of them, and each one was better than the last. So oh, wow. uh, the presentation with this one, I do enjoy it. Um, I also want to add that this one has the capital G, whereas the one with the gold cap has the capital F. And so they kind of inverted it in that sense to create a little bit of a differentiation. But all in all, I think it's a wonderful sense. So, Chris, thank you so much for sharing it with me. I really appreciate it. Oh, no problem. Thanks for me having your channel. We really appreciate it. And I just want to add one thing. Definitely subscribe to his channel. He does amazing videos, and this guy knows his stuff in and out like it's just amazing <laughs> what i learned from his channel and he's going to get to 100k very soon and i want to be the first one to tell him thank you for everything you taught me and thank i really you, wish you best of luck with everything 
Thank you. It's been seven plus long years, but, you know, it's definitely going to pay off in the end. So mm -hmm. thank you very much. So once again, thank you all at home so much for tuning in. Uh, Chris's information is going to be down below as well. So definitely make sure to check him out. Also, if you are new to the channel, like Chris said, if you did take something of value from this video, I would love it if you could subscribe to me. All you need to do is click that red button in the corner. So this way, whenever I do upload future fragrance related content, it will get delivered straight to your feed. You never need to worry about missing any of my future uploads. Thanks again for watching. Love you guys, and we'll see you in the next episode. Bye.